Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is JP. I am a truck driver. I'm doing a uh, Western Star Repair Update Part 2 today. Started off the morning by calling over to the repair shop. Uh, they were in a meeting, so I called back an hour later. I spoke to the gentleman over there. He informed me that the parts runner was about five minutes away from getting the part. I said, okay, that's fantastic. So once you guys get the part back and put it in the truck, about how long will it take until you know 100% that that was the issue and the truck will be running? And he said, oh, about a day. A day? Okay, well, that's news. So, get a text from him about an hour later. Now, yesterday he told me that the part was in the shipment and that they hadn't finished sorting through the shipment, but the part was there. Well, apparently that wasn't the case. The place where they ordered the part through actually came back and said, oh, the part is on back order, so we're still trying to find one. What? What the fuck? Now, if you remember back to this video, when my AC compressor clutch went out, they had actually ordered that harness, but I never got a call back with any kind of information about that part. So I called over to Premier Truck Group and sure enough, they had that harness. Thank you. So what happens now? Well, fortunately, I got a hold of one of our drivers and he's actually coming to Denver to deliver a load early, early in the morning. And then he's going to deliver the harness to me. It, uh, it looks a little something like this. So, yeah, that's, that's what's been keeping my truck down for six days now. Are you fucking kidding me? It actually got to the point where they actually had to ask the sales rep from Daimler, the uh, parent company over Freightliner or Western Star, uh, if they could end up building the harness because parts availability is just it basically non-existent right now because of all the supply chain shortages. I'm not gonna get into the politics of all that. Let's go, Brandon. That said, I called the gentleman from the repair shop here at Stewart and Stevenson, told him the good news, said tomorrow morning, as soon as I get the part, he's gonna come to the hotel, take it back to the shop, and get it put in the truck. So hopefully I'll have more good news for you tomorrow. Hopefully the truck gets fixed. And uh, as always, thank you guys so much for watching the videos. I really do appreciate it. Feel free to like and uh, drop a comment down below. I usually am pretty good about getting back to people. Um, and if you enjoy this content, I know it's not the best coming to you live from the Renaissance in Denver. But, um, you know, I just wanted to give everybody an update. So thank you again, and uh, I'll have an update for you tomorrow.